Hello. Monday morning was the coldest night of the season so far, and it's going to be frosty again on Monday night. By and large, through the rest of today, though, it's dry, it's bright, it's sunny spells, but it is on the chilly side. It's turned cold because we're between weather systems, a weather window, if you like, low pressure to the east across the near continent, and another one, a big one, out in the Atlantic. Between those two weather systems, as I said, many places had clear skies overnight, and that's why it was so very frosty. Not completely clear. Notice there are some shower clouds just dribbling down through the uh, North Sea into parts of East Anglia. Cold wind blowing here as well. And there are also one or two fog patches, which will be rather stubborn and slow to clear over northwest England and southern Scotland. But most places dry and bright with some autumn sunshine. Temperatures recovering after that uh, chilly old start, but it doesn't feel too warm out there at all. Temperatures mostly still in single figures, maybe eight or nine across the far east, but there is that brisk wind, don't forget, and where the fog sticks, well, temperatures will struggle to get much above freezing. There will again be that frost forming fairly quickly through this evening as well, and again we'll see some fog, probably a bit more fog through uh, Tuesday morning compared to Monday morning. It's likely to be quite dense for Tuesday morning's rush hour. Notice the breeze picking up though in Northern Ireland and the cloud thickening up here. That means that temperatures uh, by dawn will probably be back above freezing across Northern Ireland, but elsewhere we will have that frost forming and temperatures really falling away. These are values in towns and cities, but in rural areas we will be well down to minus four, minus five, quite widely across the heart of the UK. And, across uh, some sheltered glens of Scotland, we could drop down to minus eight or minus nine. Minus one or two is possible in Northern Ireland for a time, but it will be turning milder here as we go through the night because the breeze will pick up, the cloud will be increasing as well. And later on, we could just see a bit of rain trickling in. For most places, though, it's another dry, fine day, but there will be some fog patches, stubborn, slow to clear fog patches for the morning rush hour. And for some, they could even linger into the afternoon. So uh, just be aware of that for Tuesday. But again, many places looking dry and bright with some sunshine. But again, after a frosty start, don't expect anything too mild. Temperatures five or six degrees in many places. Lower than that if the fog sticks around. Further west, notice temperatures are creeping up. But that breeze will be picking up as well as we start to see this weather front, this line of rain just trickling in across Northern Ireland, perhaps into parts of Pembrokeshire and Cornwall through the course of Tuesday evening. Again, further east, it'll be light wind, so it'll turn frosty and it will turn foggy. Overall, though, as we go through the rest of this week, very slowly it's going to be turning a little bit milder as the breeze picks up from the south. There will be some rain this week, but not much of it in the east it's uh, mostly going to be in western areas. We'll have a full week ahead forecast available for you on our YouTube channels and on Facebook by Monday afternoon.